see the pain. Don't sanitize this war. If you're going to take a country to war, be brave enough to show them the consequence and the sacrifices that are being made. And I say again, this is only one example of uh, what's going on across the heartland. You know, what, what started as this big amorphous mountain of material became this really dynamic thread that is very revealing and an expose of sorts of how we got there and a lesson not just for the future but for the present as we hear the echo of that drumbeat having to do with Iran happening now that hopefully this will remind people not to let it happen again. Um, some of the scenes were incredibly painful and distressing to see and um, I'm just interested in your process about opening up. There, there, yeah, there got to be a point in the movie where it, it became the more you show, the more people will see because every one of us that uh, enlisted, we, we all knew full well that we could come back home uh, in one piece or not at all. But I, I, I doubt very many of us thought that we would come home, we could come home in a wheelchair or use, needing a ventilator to breathe through or being completely dependent on, by, on our family members for every single aspect of our daily lives. And that's when it, that was when I decided once I thought people need to see this because I want maybe 18 and 19 year old boys and girls to go home and say, hey mom, hey dad, what about federal Stafford loans or Pell grants for college? Maybe we can wait until after 2008 for me to talk about that enlistment contract. <laughs>